Hello everyone, welcome to Mutants Genetic Gladiators. This is so exciting because they have some new mutants out here in the shop, and we're gonna take a look at these guys. We have this exclusive mutant uh, that looks like a hamster in a ball with like a cool mech thing with guns. It's so amazing. There's grappling guns at the side, and it just looks so cool. So this mutant has um, health starting off base, at 1272 it is pretty slow though but i believe that it's a stronger mutant because usually mutants that are kind of slower tend to have cataclysmic attacks cataclysmic power and also we have where'd she go there she is we have britani she's for five dollars she's an exclusive mutant as well her speed is really slow because she's a zombie but she has fierce attack and she must have with that huge whatever that thing is so here he is, the cute little exo cookie hamster. Let's place him down. We can put him in the little hatchery thing right here. Come on, place you. There we go. I wanna see this guy in action. All right, it's only 10 gold to speed him up, so we're gonna do that. I need gold to transform to blah, 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 blah. Sure. So there he is. Yes, it is. Let's retrieve our hamster. So this is the hamster, guys. It's called the Exo Cookie, but it's actually a hamster in a ball. And I think it's really cool the way they put that together. Uh, its health point starting off actually is 1,351. Its speed is 3.33, and it has the two attacks, Wheel of Destiny and High Velocity. Let's read its biography and info. Exo Cookie is at the origin of everything in Darwin's life, believe it or not. When he was only seven years old, he could not bear the idea that his favorite hamster would only live three to four years tops. Darwin, therefore, uh, where'd I go? Oh man, I lost my spot. Oh, there I am. Darwin, therefore, did everything that was in his power to extend his lifespan. He was surely stunned when he discovered that his first experiment turned his little cookie into a Hulk-like hamster, traveling at the speed of light and destroying everything in its way. Darwin had to give him a new name and to build him a suitable piece of equipment. Let's just say that the success opened the way to what Darwin has become. Exo Cookie has now entered the arena. He may seem cute, but he sure will be pitiless towards his opponents. All right, I'm gonna call you Hantaro because you're so cool. If you guys don't know what Ham Taro is, shame on you. You need to go look that up. So that's what he looks like. You can see he's like way bigger than Sailor Moon here. Woohoo! Level up, baby! There goes high velocity activated. That's so cool. And there is Wheels of Destiny. So now we're ready for battle. We put Ham Taro in with the other guys. And you can see we have like all the mythics, uh, all the uh, elements here fighting against these guys. So we just want to test them out. We're going to use David as our tag. It's Hantaro's turn. So we're going to use high velocity against this beetle guy right here. We're not going to use a tag team because we don't need to. Let's just slow this down so you can see it at its best. There we go. All right. He's still a baby, so he's not altogether strong. So please excuse him. There we go. Now for next wave. The only thing you have to consider also when you have the um, the Exo Cookie Mutant is that it is very slow, but that's why it has cataclysmic attacks because when it is finally time for it to do its thing, it's going to be awesome. So let's tag team and get rid of this person here. Oh my gosh, you have one of those. Those look so cool. It's an Afro princess thing. I totally want that. All right, Connor, it is your turn. Connor's probably gonna kill this thing, so I, I don't know, but let's, because I want Ham Tower to do it. There we go, I want him to finish it off. All right, and we're gonna use the other attack, Wheels of Destiny, that is strong against Warrior. And it's a kill shot. So that is the Exo Cookie, guys. Remember, he is in the, uh, he's gonna be in the shop, and also you can win him in the mutant slots. He's a really cool mutant to have if you want, like, powerhouses. And don't forget to check out these other awesome mutants in the shop. And that's it. All right, guys, see you later. And don't forget to stop by my channel to see other awesome content on Mutants Tonight Gladiators and other fighting games. All right, see you later. That's the last time now, I promise.